Hello and welcome back to my Let's Play on Total War Sugar. Uh, Free Kingdoms. Free Kingdoms, guys, not Sugar 2. Uh, with Sima Young on a legendary difficulty, where last time we left off, we were sallied out on at Luoyang, the capital of the Jin Empire. Um, we have a pretty tough army up against us here. Uh, the initial army is actually it's, it's above average, I'd say. It's got a couple of Saber infantry and Pearl Dragons. Couple of cav, which aren't too great, but either way, you know, it's got some units that you don't see very often. Um, and then the garrison is a scary part. They've got four units of cataphracts, three units of protectors of heaven, three units of protectors of earth. Sorry, defenders of earth, and uh, a Dao infantry captain. Actually, she's nice. I, I was afraid they were gonna have another cav unit. So yeah, the, the catafra heavy cataphracts too. By the way, these aren't regular cataphracts. Look at the armor, sixty-two percent. That actually is higher than I've ever seen. That is fucking insane, by the way. I actually kind of want to see these guys just, like, looking at them. Um, we have, uh, you know, two basic armies. Nothing particularly insane. I think we do have, hopefully, enough anti-cavalry to stop their cavalry, though. Because they have got six units of cav. Um, if they can make those heavy cataphracts charge into my uh, spear guards... Sorry, I think we'll be alright. Um, because of the way anti-cav works. But we'll have to see. We're also still besieging... Sima Liang's final town, which we had just fought at as well. Uh, hopefully after that battle we can now just auto resolve that when it gets back to, around to our turn. We'll have to wait and see exactly whether that'll be possible or not. As far as I'm aware, there's still one army on the way as well towards that. So if I were to auto resolve it and my army is basically dead, we just get seized out immediately by the enemy and that would suck. So we'll see. We'll see. Right, I'm gonna sit back as far as humanly possible uh, and make make sure that my trebuchets get onto the field. Uh, well, I, everything gets onto the field, but most importantly, the trebuchets. You guys are gonna sit in the center, and then we're gonna have our spears around the flanks, essentially. I'm gonna put you guys over here, and then the two other ones will come in. Well, actually, I'm gonna put them further back, probably, and then the, the actual spear guards are gonna go here, and then these guys are gonna go here, and then the same goes on the other side. Hello from the other side! All right, and we got, uh, you can go up front. We have uh, the melee evasion buff. You've got range blo <laughs> bluff, yep. All right, and you got the debuff too. That's pretty good. All right. Let's set them up, boys. Got ourselves a champion, always good. Don't think they've got anything particularly amazing characters or anything, so that's good. Right, so you guys are gonna go here. You guys are gonna go there. And these two are gonna go kind of here, I guess. You guys are all gonna go on the left side, and then you two are gonna go here. Although that might have been might be a bit too far wide, to be honest. I don't I don't care that much exactly. As long as they're cap charge into my spears, it's all good. It doesn't really matter exactly how it works out. Okay, you guys are all gonna go right there. And you two are gonna go right here. Okay, and then I'm actually going to start sending uh, send you up that way. Have a look. Go have a cheeky peek, would you? Oh, you got 75 speed. Let's do you instead. Um, yeah, I'm not 100% sure about this formation with these guys. Simply because I really need their calf to charge into my spears. My Britney spears. So, I'm tempted to perhaps even... Remove a couple units from here, make this make the spears go further on the middle as well. Because sometimes the cab does charge into the middle. If they do, like the, I think the only weird way we can kill those cat effects is by having our generals murder or sorry, our um, anti cavalry murder them. Like by having them charge into my anti cavalry, I should really specifically say. Um you need to move up as well. If we fight them the normal way, I don't see that going well. What is that unit though? There's a spear unit going there. You two are supposed to both get, both going be going there. Did I accidentally put? No, that looks all fine. I don't know what happened. All right, they're probably meeting up with the reinforcements, which sucks for the most part. Because again, protectors of heaven, defenders of earth. I do believe because uh, the new patch notes are out for patch 1.2.0, I think it is. Uh, which by the time you see this, will have been out for fucking ages. By the way. Um, <laughs> But, um, because it's coming alongside the uh, Eight Princes DLC, and today's the 7th of August. I just uploaded my first episode, actually. Um, but anyway, that's that's coming out soon. 
Um, and yeah, I'm not going to use it on this Let's Play, obviously, for quite a while until it does come out. Um, okay, there they are. But anyway, in that patch notes, I haven't actually read them properly yet. I need to have a, look, a proper look at them, but uh, it does say that... Um, I, I saw some people complain or mention that the... Um, Defenders of Earth are going to get a nerf. So yeah. They're going to get a little bit weaker, but it should be okay. Right. Uh, there are Pearl, Dra Pearl Dragons protectors we haven't yet. They're, they're in a full formation right now, which is a bit shit for us, unfortunately. Uh, trebuchets are going to get there in time, at least. So that's nice. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? I am going to move this entire army minus the trebuchets. Just a little bit like that to match up a little bit better with what's happening what's happening pal so you put you guys up a little bit further as well all right where's their calf uh there's the regular couple of units of calf where's their cataphracts though because that's the shit i'm worried about okay you guys are getting in range or in position that's good this one might not quite be there for the first shot but could even make it stop right here, to be honest. Okay, first shot's fired. They had no strategist in here, did they? No, so they have no loose formation. That's very good. Um, okay, I'm kind of tempted to let them fire at will, but... I should just fire over there somewhere. A lot of units to be hit around here. Okay, here's some good units to hit. Protectors of Heaven, always good. There's the heavy cataphracts right there okay so these shots while our accuracy is quite low our experience is pretty low we can just get a random couple of hits all over these units preferably if we don't keep shooting short like that seems to be a main thing is that we're always shooting short look at that every shot is short when you're low accurate or low experience there again short i don't know how they keep doing it it's such a common thing so I tend to start firing into locations rather than actual units. But anyway, there's a couple of really good targets right there. You already have someone firing at that though. Okay, they're coming towards us now. Whoever's firing over here needs to stop. You gotta stop. Don't know who it was though. Um, it's one of these ones, obviously. Did I already have someone firing in there? I don't know. I believe it was that one. Unbelievable. The last one I tried. Okay. Uh, oh shit, there's the cataphracts. Okay. Bring you guys back here. Oh, nope. I'm not going to do any jewels. Thanks. Although I'm not sure actually how good are those characters. Fucking hell. Um, where am I? Where's my information? I'm going to deny that one for now, but I think I will accept that one. You and you are definitely denying all requests for jewels. Are you and well equipped? Yeah, you're alright equipped. Okay, even with that armor, we're still taking them down with crossbows a little bit. They're also still coming from a somewhat awkward angle. I'm going to get my cab over towards the flank here now, though. Okay, yeah, charge straight in, please. That's fantastic. See, that one I might take. Jiamei, he looks like he's more well equipped than the other guy. No, I'm definitely not taking that one. Okay, I'm taking range shit now. Please stop offering the jewels to me. Oh my god, I think it's getting fucking destroyed. Uh, we did nothing against these cataphracts, it seems. Okay, they kind of charge into my swords as well. They charge into my swords. Damn! That's exactly what I was trying to prevent, and that's exactly what ended up happening. Okay, um... You guys. Trying to find your own targets, I think. Okay, you can target uh, this guy now. We got some debuffs too, not with you though. You. Okay, we still did some damage to the cataphracts, but not a whole lot. I'm gonna start sending you guys around here as well. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there, everyone! Get in here! I also need to get some units over here, because we are about to fucking get broken through over here. Um, do that. A little bit of that. Get in here. You need to use your debuff here. 
Uh, that's an enemy, that's an enemy. Where am I? Fucking melee generals. Oh my god, we're routing already. Where was that? Over here. What? The fuck happened there? Okay, calf. Time to stop running around like a mad lad. Just get in there now. Got a fucking G militia. Can you please route? That would be great for me. I need you guys to get in here. Right, yeah. So you have you available to do something useful. Go kill some people over there. Get that buff off as well. Buff off. That buff off as well. Protect heaven. We're not going to do fucking anything against them. with charge in the back, but still. Get in there. Get in there. Keep running around. Okay, get in there. Get in... Darish. Get over there. Everyone, get in here. Is she well equipped? Uh, not really. Are you? Yeah, you're definitely better equipped. Yeah, go for it. A little bit lower HP, but that's okay. Alright. Get out. Get out. Get out. Uh, stay in there. Okay, there come my uh, reinforcements right on fucking time, because we're about to get broken through over there. Okay. Uh, ooh, they've gotten through over here a little bit. Uh, quite a bit, in fact. Not, not just a little bit. Quite a decent amount of getting in there. Okay, I need to fucking murder those troops real goddamn quick. Okay, you chase off these guys. I need to make sure I kill off actual units as well, of course. Because, again, this is one of those battles where afterwards we gotta win this one. After we, after we win it, we have to take the town like, with an auto resolve, pre um, preferably. So yeah, their calves wrecking me over here, my calves wrecking them over there, so... Over here. Except that protectors of heaven unit, which I'm doing fucking nothing against. <laughs> By the way. <laughs> oh shit, yeah, you may want to run away there. Hello. Good fucking timing on that. Okay, we're riding... Uh, ooh, yeah, I think we're mass riding them, actually. How's the shooting doing over here? Yes, about to be mass route. There we go. Okay, we actually won. I I mean, I, I, re I think... I knew we were winning, but I didn't really expect it to happen there. Did you mount up? You did mount up. Well, go kill some generals for me. If you wouldn't mind... What the fuck was that? It's the amount of ammo shot that one unit. Alright, so the left flank definitely folded pretty hard. The right flank was about to fold as well. The middle was doing okay, but actually somewhat low as well, if we're being honest here. Um, so yeah, that was actually... Oh, that unit's dead. They're dead. They're about to be dead. They're dead already. Dead. Go try and get over there, I guess. Yes, yes. Good. Let's kill some different people, shall we? Uh, wait. Who? Oh, that's a... That's not a guy. Sorry. Yeah, go kill that anyway. You too. You should be able to kill that person, hopefully. That lady. Those are dead. That unit's gone in the way. Yeah, I think we killed enough that we can probably auto resolve this. They're not going to take any attrition just yet, though. Um, you and you, because we're not really catching this this person. We have two generals we can definitely still kill. That one's going to get away, but that is most of the generals dead, I think. Is this unit dying? That's the protectors of heaven. They're not dying at all. You guys need to get the fuck out of there. Let these calves do it. Do it. Are you guys doing anything in here? 23. I think that's dead. Oh, I think that's dead. Keep chasing, please. Not paying you for nothing. Please kill this lady off now. Men cannot fire. They have no ammunition. If I was all this, I'll definitely lose a couple of armies, or a couple of units. <laughs> Several armies will be dead. Yeah, she actually lost her jewel, which was unexpe or ex unexpected. I, I should have used her buff at some point. I kind of forgot. Uh, she got away already. Well, let's try and kill this one off at least. And you really... Okay, there you go. I was going to say, you really... Ought to okay, there we go. All of a sudden, everyone's fucking dead. Right, there's still that unit, although that one's probably dead now. This one's just... <laughs> I don't know what's happening here. Having a very hard time killing this unit. Um, and then there's a unit over here, but I think you actually got them down. Yeah, five. Oh, that's a saber range for so no one cares. You've got that one killed as well. So just this one here. And I need, I need to kill as much as possible of that, to be honest. Um, but I think they're about to get away here. If only I could six topple speed. Yeah, they're going to get away. They're not, not killing them at all. <laughs> what in the world? Use this route. Thanks. All right. 
Hopefully I can still resolve that. I'm not sure. Uh, if, you know, worst comes to worst, I'll siege him out for a little bit longer. We seem to have killed almost everything in that army, though. I think uh, two cav units maybe survived and one infantry and one archer unit. But I think that's it. So four units survived, I think. And the general. And here... Yeah, a couple as well. I'm going to recruit this man. Minus two satisfaction, this army. Plus one satisfaction, this county. Interesting. Um... I don't know. It's not bad. It's not great. He's 51 years old already. Eh, fuck it. Let him go. I will take the replenishment, if you don't mind. And we got ourselves a level up. Always nice. Nice. You want uh, to be my vassal if I give you autonomy, etc. Nope, sorry, mate. I just did. Please come and just kill yourself. Kill your army on my land now, please. It is time. It is time for you to die. Still making nine grand per turn. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Mass mobilization. That must be some fucking movement range, right? We're working on that one. So we got, uh, oh yeah, mustering and recruitment cost. So with the mustering reduced by two turns as well, I feel like we're going to get, if we recruit a new army, it's going to be full in like one turn. So that's going to give me the retinue upkeep cost, uh, which is going to increase my money even further, and then the 15% campaign movement range. And that also is going to unlock those heavy cataphracts. Very nice. Also, this is going to unlock the tribal horse harders. Right, so that army fucked off, actually. So this is going to be... Oh no, it's definitely, it's definitely decisive. Still medium losses. I think I'm going to fight this one manually. It's only 94% wall strength. This, <laughs> if I auto resolve this, I'm gonna lose several units. I can guarantee it. If I fight it manually, <clears throat> there's literally 110 dudes there. But if my trebuchets don't kill them, I guess I can blow a hole in the wall. Ah, uh, it's too many towers though. I'd have to kill them with my trebuchets. If I don't, I'm gonna lose a lot of. I guess if I don't, I lose a lot of men. But I would lose a lot of men either way. So. Yeah, I'll fight that one manually. Fuck it. The ranger's outfit. Don't know if anyone wants that. Actually, there's probably someone out there who wants that. Such as... You. Nope. You, my friend. Ah, there you go. Oh, shit. You had a... Wait, are you in an army? No, you're an administrator. Well, give that back, son. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, Alright, yeah, you're not, you don't get shit. You fucking bastard. Trying to pretend you're some kind of big general boy. Bian Chang doesn't like Bian Bing. Alright, fair enough. Uh, you are actually pretty good. You're also 64 years old. Why is everyone in this game fucking old as heck? You're a good and then you're also kind of disappointing again. And Ji Song. Eh, you're pretty decent, but if I need you, I'll get you. And we ranked up on several dudes and dudettes. Right, so this probably will be an auto resolve. Although we've been, we've been besieging that one for ages, so. Range block chance or charge speed? Uh, both are pretty fine. I, uh, I'm gonna go that way regardless, but I'm also regardless gonna get this stuff, so. Yeah, let's take the range block chance. Right, is this auto resolvable? Still medium losses. Yeah, that works. There goes all of my fucking food, by the way. Ooh, sunny side up. I got an achievement. What does that do? Uh, playing as any of the eight prince princes faction, capture the settlement of Luoyang. Fair enough. An oncom. Of course there is. Oh, of course there is, isn't there? Bai Shushang. Or Bei Shushang, that would be. You are pretty good, Bei. Did I choose you to keep you or did you also just join me and it's once once again one of those things where it's like i'm gonna join your faction too but i'm not gonna tell you about it all right Jin empire of a new capital is it just the nearest town over uh no it doesn't look like it well i could have checked what it was but i didn't so there you go see my food is fucking wrecked now we got the trade port and the lumber yard so that's um commerce income peasantry income so we're definitely gonna go for commerce income here 
a grand tea house. Uh, ooh, I definitely don't want to sell my food. Yeah, minus 60 food. This building is not helping me right now. Income industry, yep, that can stay around. Uh, food production, probably getting rid of that. I don't think I want this. 40% income from industry. I, I don't think so. That building is definitely staying now. Okay, so I'm demolishing one building right now. Two buildings. Alright, what would I want here? Because we haven't got a marketplace yet, so that's definitely one. Another one would certainly be the military infrastructure. And then the last building. Oh, this is actually not even the right building, so I'm definitely demolishing that too. And this is going to repair it. Okay, yeah. E. Cool. Uh, we'll look at all those other buildings in a moment. Right, you can fuck off now. Mostly you just need to replenish. You also gotta level up. Good man. Um, let's go down that way, I think. Battle running speed is pretty important, to be honest. Okay, I think we're gonna start preparing for this war over here now. You also gotta level up. Well, 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 would you look at that? Another level 7 character. You're gonna go that way. Okay. So we're gonna attack here. No, I don't... I, I was hoping they were gonna do that, actually, but... Because there was a Jin Empire army around here, wasn't there? I don't know where that's gone. Um, I mean, this is the main thing right now. We've got to level up here as well. You're level 3, right. So I can replace the Cav here now, which is really good. Uh, yeah, let's just take this first. Right. I just, I'm, I, I, if I do, if I auto resolve this, I'm losing like these units, like, mo uh, yeah, it wouldn't be good. All the cavalry will probably be dead, but that's okay, because I'm replacing them right away anyway. If I could demand surrender, it would be great, but I, I can't, because there's no character in here, plus this is their final town, so they wouldn't take it anyway. I guess I should just fight it. There's two units. There will be a siege tower somewhere that will be destroyed. So... Sorry, she's tower. A tower, sorry. Ah, sorry, guys. Sage words, friend. They shall echo through history. This guy want to say something, too? You got something to say, old man? Huh? Oh, yeah, here you go. Fucking Dongmo. Were you a traitor at one point? <laughs> I seem to recall. Right, any... I mean, it's 94%, so there's got to be a tower somewhere that's destroyed, right? One would imagine. There it is, right there. Okay, there's no wall, um, no portions of the wall. Actually, this entire section is broken. Okay, we have loads of space here. Only two traps on that one, but it's still better than I expected, actually, so. You gotta drop that. Boyo. Okay, and then the cab is useless. You're definitely not gonna be doing anything. You might do something. Experiencing some lag. I'm not sure what's going on. Ooh, actually, I think I do know what's going on. Hold on, give me one second. I knew exactly what was going on. I don't know why that is. I, f I noticed it throughout the entire episode, by the way, but I was like, I don't know what the fuck this is, so just let it be for now. But for some reason, when I leave Prime Video in the background, like, um, you know, the, the Amazon Prime, when I leave that on in the background uh, on my computer, for some reason, my entire computer just kind of lags. It just jitters a little bit. The same goes with Netflix, although I think that's been fixed uh, at some point for me. Such a weird thing. Why does Prime fuck up my my computer in, in that way? It's just so weird to me. Okay, there's one unit we can hopefully blow up. Where's the other one? The other one's on the wall, so we can move up our crossbows to murder that one. That should also be... should all be okay, hopefully. It's gotta hit him enough to kill it. So far this is going poorly. Having said that, I might honestly be able to get my crossbows in range as well, to be honest. Hopefully I don't run out of fucking ammo here. Let's get you up anyway. <laughs> this is sad. We hit it- oh, there we go, we hit it once more. Come on, boys, kill this fucking unit off. I don't even know if I can get my crossbows in range, but okay, there we go. Should have enough ammo left if I can. Yeah, I can definitely get him in range, so we should be good. 
We'll be fine. Let's see where these guys are already in range. Fire boys. Still a bit weird about Total War games that you can randomly see a unit f over a wall. We know exactly where to fire. It just doesn't really make much sense, but. Didn't even get inside the town, and we still won. Glad I decided to fight that one. Not lo losing any units will definitely help out here. Again, I think there's an army on the way, so. But even if there isn't, if we get attacked by someone else or whatever, definitely worth making sure we keep our dudes alive. We're on minus seven food. Fucking great. We're destroying some buildings, though. And also fixing these ones up, shoot, hopefully. Fix my problems. More food, less problems. Uh, it's an iron mine. What the fuck? It's an iron mine. Okay, well, in that case... Yeah, this is going to be a... Um, it's not going to be a food province, this. So I'm fixing everything except for that one. Keeping the two food buildings for the moment, I guess. But I will probably uh, remove them at some point. Replace the... Uh, well, def this is definitely getting replaced with the military infrastructure. But I need to at least build the state workshops. I mean, to be fair, I, I only really need to build the state workshops. And I guess the private workshops would be okay. But I already have those. So just the state state workshops. And then I guess the Confucian, Confucian temples will replace the other building. But we'll see. Um, capture two enemy capitals. Yep, I know that. Do you want peace? Oh yeah, he does, of course, but it's an alliance piece, which I don't want. Um, who's Sima Chi? Who the fuck are you, you little bitch? You're in a alliance with Sima Wei. Are you... Oh shit, see my ways in an alliance? I didn't even realize this. Okay, I'll become friends with you. Are you a vassal of Sima Wei? Is that what's going on? You're in a. Sima Wei's in a big alliance with a whole bunch of people. Oh, Ma Wen! <laughs> Our old alliance mate. It seems. Oh shit, Song Wei. No! Oh no, it's over here, but still. I can't attack this guy now because otherwise it would fuck me over with Sima Wei. I was, I was afraid it was this one for a second, but luckily that's not the case. Got to be careful soon, though, because there's a bunch... I mean, this alliance. Gu Jian, I think he's the one to the south. Yeah, that's him. Then we got Ma Wen. He's over here. We got Ruan Yi. That's this guy right here. And then Song Wei, who's this one over here. So, yeah, we can't attack this. Anywhere else, we can, we're still pretty much fair game for now. Uh, yeah, I'll be friends with you. I'll be friends with you. Uh, yeah, it's not gonna happen. You got any money for me? Oh. Uh, I mean, I could, or I could take some insta money. I don't really need insta money, to be honest. Fuck it. Um, oh, I got rid of the wrong, the wrong one. Yeah, fuck it, I'll take... You know what, just... Whatever, dude. <laughs> I don't need your 400 bucks over 10 turns. Um... Man, I don't need your shit. Who the fuck do you think you are? I'll take this fishing port upgrade. I also will take this horse pasture right here, if you don't mind. Uh, I'm also going to auto absorb that one. This army's first battle, I believe. I made this army to stop the Simaliang onslaught, but then we kind of stopped it with all the other armies, so... Now we're here. Definitely upgrading that as soon as damn possible. Uh, and I'm going to be upgrading this building. Because why not? Still got 20k left over. And a bunch of armies to move. Right, I could take this lumber yard right away. Right away. You've also not been moved for a while. You can't quite reach that. But you can, I think that's a reinforcement range, though. I think we're okay in this place. If we were to get besieged, we have a huge garrison, so that's okay. You need to replenish for a while. Oh, yeah, I saw them. Before I do anything else, these boys getting the replacements. Could also go for the cataphracts now. Uh, I kind of want to, but those are so expensive to recruit. It's not its not like I can't even afford it either, to be honest. I probably will actually just get those at some point. Also, yeah, look at that insane replenishment we have now. You guys are on free experience, otherwise I'd replace you right now. I still would like to get Pearl Dragons, but they just don't make sense to put on the flank. Um, Yeah, just keep it like this for now. Once I get Protectors of Heaven, I'm definitely replacing those two units and every army with them. Um, 
you guys can't have cataphracts. That's unfortunate. I think otherwise I probably would. I will probably replace all my calf with these ones. I would need some better fucking calf because these guys just do not do the damage. They don't do it. Uh, these guys have got the same damage. These guys have got slightly higher. These have, these have got a higher charge bonus, but I'm not too concerned about that. Surprisingly, this unit has the lowest morale. Although this one is higher because of the experience, I suppose. Um... Yeah, I think I'm going to get... You know what, I'm going to do this right now, in fact. Ooh, no. Nope. Sorry. Let's get some better looking calf in all of our armies. I'm going to spend all my money on that right now. We've got several armies to do this in, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to afford all of it. Uh, we can recruit those because it's a unique unit, but nah. I mean, we, we, I want to stick to the, the color scheme also. I don't think I'm... Yeah, I can't do any other armies. I've got, I've got one more there. I think that's it, as far as my yellow general's armies go. You got them, you got them, you got them. So yeah, I just need to re replace the last ones in here. Tempted to attack this place. Could just siege them out. Again, I just want to take this town before I peace out with them. So you know what? I'm just going to besiege them. There was an army around here from uh, the Jin Empire, but I don't know where they went, so... That's not going to happen. Pretty large garrison, but this is my best army by far. I'm not gonna fight it. Eh, or am I? Could just blow them up in there. They're never gonna come out though, so it would literally just be be firing my. You know what? Yeah, you know. Yeah, I'll. Ye, ye, ye. Um. Yeah, I'll do this. We can see what they do. They don't sally out. Fine. We do as much damage as possible with our trebuchets, and then we just back off, and then we keep sieging them out. That's fine by me. It'll give us a draw. I'm not going to choose the system. If, if it gives me the option to fight them several more times, I'm not going to. Ooh, one thing that consider, actually, is that they could, after this turn ends, uh, they could sail out. We've seen, we've seen that before. Sima Jiang, he did it too, his army. We besieged him, and he was like, yeah, you know what? I'm out of here. <laughs> and I was a bit flabbergasted by that. But, um, yeah, that he could do that. Something to keep in mind. But other than that, doesn't really matter. If he does, so, if yeah, if they do so, I can still uh, peace out with them anyway. Not sure if they were also available to vassalize, but right, if they do come out, that'd be fantastic. But they're not. Okay, fair enough. Didn't expect you to. Uh, let's. I can't hit that far. Nope. In here, please. I'm just gonna do as much damage as possible, really. Oh, they got loose formation available too, unfortunately. I could also just blow up the towers and actually go for a proper attack. But, I don't know. I think I'm going to move you guys up. If they're not coming towards me, I might as well just get the best shots possible while not being in range of the towers, right? Already routed some stuff. It's about doing as much damage as possible here, though. Not about routing them. Row. This guy's getting, oh my god, I did not mean to do that. Getting Irvin Rampart somehow, even though the guy's standing still, as far as I'm aware. I would say that's triple speed, but <laughs> unfortunately that's already what I'm already doing. Um, I like how he kept units over there. I guess, you know, when you get that many units, you may as well just pop them all over the place. Can I get all the way into shooting at those units right there? Get hit that one, and then my random shots might hit some other units too. Actually, let's have one of you fire there, one of you fire over here. I wonder which one will be more accurate. There's quite a few units to hit around there, even if I, like, hit only a little bit. Oh, and those are the garrison units, it seems, because they're not going into loose formation. Not doing a ton of damage, though, I gotta admit. Let's hit, those, uh, hit that one right there for me. Again, it's all about doing as much damage as possible here. I'm not expecting them to come out. I'm just, you know, killing a couple hundred dudes and then moving away. Again, I could have perhaps blown up the towers and just gone in, but... I don't think it's necessary. Okay. Actually, that was a pretty good target right there for a little bit. Doing a lot of damage. Eh, uh, that's not that great. Fire over there. There's a great blob right there. Can we get some shots in there, please? 
Yeah, that was what I was afraid of. Have to be a pinpoint accurate fucking shot for that to work out. Ugh, no, nah, it's not working out. Far over there, please. You might be able to do it because you've got a better angle, I suppose, but... Even then, it's not great. Let's try one or two shots. There's a lot of units around there. And then they started moving, so now my shot's gonna hit the wall again here. Yep, never mind that shot. Fire back in there again. Six from... Uh, percent remaining. Yeah, you're gonna run out of ammo here soon. Let's fire a couple of volleys in there. Not a lot of damage though. In fact, maybe it is worth. Should I? No, I won't be able to do this anymore. I can still get inside and try and capture the towers, I suppose. Might just ride that unit there. Maybe not. Yep, there goes that one. And should be our last volley coming up now. There it goes, that was quick. Alright. Oh, we're being shot. Who the fuck's... What? No, oh, stop. Oh my god, I lost so many dudes there. I lost enough that I don't... I don't think I have four trebuchets in the next battle. Damn, that's actually kind of rough. Do I try and get in there and finish this off right now? Uh, you know what? I will. Fuck it. I have turtle formation. Let's just move up. I've seen this before. We did this exact same thing before, in fact. They're just going to go right there, and then you guys are going to move up behind them and start murdering everything from range. And then the towers are going to kill me, but it's going to be such a small amount of death that it doesn't matter. I'm going to keep you guys behind for now. Okay, I think we're in range to start firing at that unit there. Here we go. Yeah, they do have loose formation. Which is unfortunate. I kind of keep forgetting about that, but oh well. Being fired back on apparently. Oh, they're firing at them. Never mind. That's totally fine with me. There goes a unit. Yeah, keep firing at all my dudes. I'm just going to make them run out of ammo, basically. While marching my way in there. Yeah, let's focus on, or like, f move towards that. You guys are fine, actually. Basically, just, um. Get in there. I'm uh, I'm just like fucking testudo for my shing up here. Fire in there for me. Actually, you guys might want to fire something else, but okay. If I can capture the towers, great. If not, eh, I'm not too worried about it. Just gonna jump in there, mass ride them all. You have the debuffs, yeah, you do. It's a bit dangerous to bring you over here though, but I'll still bring you a little bit closer, I suppose. Are you guys firing over there? Apparently you are. I'm not seeing a lot of damage though. The rally, our general needs aid. Debuff these shits. Get him out of here. Kill Kong Shumin, please. She's had it in for me for years now. I don't know who that is. Okay, you're gonna get in there. I think we're gonna capture the tower soon. And a flag. Are you being shot right now? Oh, you most certainly are. Get in there quickly! Okay, we fucking slaughtered that. Actually, we didn't really do much damage there. Wait, did we kill? No, we didn't kill anyone yet. Get in here. My two units might need some backup now, you guys. Time to get in there. You guys are basically done tanking shit. Let's get the fuck in there as well. Towers are being taken now. We're destroying those two units over there. I'm gonna move up a little bit and let you fire at whatever you want to fire at for now. Uh, are we debuffing? Okay, we need to do that. That guy's getting fucking destroyed. Or at least his morale seems to be showing us that he's getting fucking destroyed. Get over there, let's cover the right side a little bit. Maybe time to give up the Testudo formation. Let's get in there. Give me that uh, debuff again, please. I want to see a mass route. You're going to see a bunch of routing here. What else have we got left here? The Cav and these two, but they're fine. Cavalry, maybe. Start moving them up here, I guess. But Okay. So I like the amount of routing I'm seeing here. Let's run you guys over that way, I guess. Uh, infantry is going to kind of set up in this area here. Maybe not like that. Eh, fuck it, we're still fighting stuff. Get back in there. Kill this unit here. Actually, kind of want to keep you over here as well. 
fuck that point. I was gonna take the point so they have a lower morale, but... Uh, actually, you know what, go take that. If you can do that real quick, I might just be able to ma make a mass ride on that alone. Okay, just get fucking in there, please. Just stay away from those towers there in the middle. And we'll be okay. You guys are actually out of ammo already. You guys must be really low too. 5 and 21. Yeah, I'll move you up a little bit, but... Okay, you guys, you got stuck in here. Ignore that unit for me. Let's get in there. Anyone wants to fucking face shoot, then they can do so. They're welcome to come and try. We seem to have lost our uh, momentum a little bit here. But yeah, if I can capture this. They're all coming back now. <laughs> Fall back! Fall back to the keep! Aragorn, get your men out of there! The reference. Oof. Actually almost fucking get this just right now. Get this unit out of here. No, get back in before we start losing it again. Okay, make them routes, just stay over here. Uh where's my general at? What the fuck are you doing over here? Okay, stop chasing that guy. Because that's gonna get you killed by those towers. Oof, glad I noticed that. That literally would have been very painful had I forgotten. Okay, we're about to take this. Once we do, I think a mass ride will immediately happen. I can't imagine our morale as much as any good right now. Okay, it's controlled by me. Uh, I'm seeing more routing going on. Almost mass ride. I'm kind of tempted to send you in here just to do a morale debuff. Look, the enemy run. Cowards! Holy fuck, now you're in here already. Oh no, she's debuffing us. But she's also routing. So, just gonna wait a couple seconds while getting shot by towers. This is actually very painful. Okay, I'll, that's all I wanted to do. Now get out of there. Hopefully that'll be enough for them to route. Oh, they're considering it. They're thinking about you need to get the fuck away from this tower as well, please. They are certainly thinking about it. There we go. That's it. Oh god, you're gonna get shot by towers. Get back. Get back. There's still one unit over here. Are you serious? This fucking unit's ruining it. You're ruining it. Stop it. There we go. Randomly, just... <laughs> They're like, wait a second. Where are you guys going? <laughs> I heard someone yell, Aragorn, get your men out of there. So, I was running, go I was going back to the keep. Alright, that was good. Killed a whole army as well as that garrison. They still have more men than I have got remaining, by the way. That was a good master at that. Oh, 611 men. Yeah, that was definitely worth doing. Uh, goodbye. Hey, hey, we did it. Current total zero. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, we did it, though. Uh, plus 40% character experience. That's pretty big. That is pretty sweet. I like that. And our mind alignment, which is not, not that sweet. Uh, yeah, that brings us closer to that minus, yeah, minus five satisfaction is something we can certainly handle, to be honest. We got a noble sword, which I'm definitely going to be able to make use for with someone. I can't believe you haven't got a better sword. Here you go. Take something at least. Also, I think I've got the money now. I got the ma- oh, you're in, this, in the water. Where are you even going right now? I guess we're going back this way, actually. Uh, let's go normal speed, if we can land as well, so I can rec replace those units and start replenishing them immediately. Immediately, yeah, because I'm going to get ready to fight this faction now. Alright, replace these bastards. I think I can just about recruit three. Never mind, I can't recruit four. Do any more battles right now? I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay, and then we got that level up on that lady, so she's now level eight. So I'm going to get another new mission soon, because I don't think I've had one for a while. You're going for the other ability, I guess. Higher chance of ambush. You're brilliant. Wow, I didn't even realize we had a brilliant lady in here the whole time. You've been here the whole time? Huh? Clever, cunning, ascetic, and charitable, brilliant woman. She's the, the fucking package, isn't she? I don't care that you're 62 years old. I'm having you for breakfast tomorrow, Puyang Yan. Uh, Alright. Um... Yeah, I'm just going to go for that ability, to be honest. doesn't really matter anymore right now. Right, I'll have you be my vassal. 
be my vassal. Um, you know what? Can you give me some territory as well? You have got... Ooh, you got all of this too. No, that's not you. You've got that one right there. Who the fuck is this then? Someone I'm on an alliance... Oh, that's the Jin Empire. I'm in an alliance war with them. It's a copper mine. I'm sure that's over here. This one then. Yeah. Yeah. What do they own in this part? Is that the province even? No, it's not, obviously. Oh, they own this fucking part. Right, okay. And that one. What the... Fuck you doing all the way over there, son? Are you enemies of these people around here? Possibly. Um, how is that? How much is that worth? I don't think I want it, but no, that's way too much anyway. Right, I'll take any ancillaries you've got. You've got a few. I'll have both of them if you don't mind. I'm sure. Well, I'm sure you do, but I don't care about that, do I? Those are worth uh, a lot to you, apparently. That's unfortunate, but I will take also any money you can spare. Uh, and of course, you know, your 20% uh, of your income. That's a fair deal, wouldn't you say? My first vassal. Oh, I'm not going to do that. Get the fuck out of here. No, I'm going to annex the shit out of you at some point if I feel like it. Uh, okay. Just always live on the brink of that. Ooh, he's going to fucking annex me. <laughs> he might do. I want him to live in that constant fear of potential vassalization or potential annexing. Are we going to be part of the strongest faction in the game? How am I respected by it right now, by the way? Fighting against enemies of the Alliance. Oh, yeah, of course. Is that the Jin Empire, though? Ooh, that's a great fucking way to get some respect. Holy shit. Be my vassal. Still hates me. Unfortunately, can't trade with him, by the way. Oh, shit. Sima Chi is actively waging war against our vassal Sima Yan. As their new lord, we now have the duty to put protection over them. As a peaceful faction to us, we should attempt to resolve this diplomatically. Should they reject our offer, we will be obliged to declare war. Oh. Who the fuck is Sima Chi? Uh, yeah. You wanna... Oh, they took it. Alright, fair enough. I mean, pretty smart. Oh, shit. Oh, Sima Wei, please. Okay, thank fuck. Oh, wait, this must be his uh, his alliance. The Sima Wei alliance is actually... Okay, well, I'm guessing they're all gonna join. There's one more, right? No, two more, I think. Oh, no, that was it. Okay, so we peaced out everyone? Or did I just declare... No, I didn't declare war on everyone. Thank fuck for that. I didn't realize you were at war, my new vassal, mate. Um, all right. We are able to peace out with her still. I can make her my vassal as well still, but like, what's the point? She just owns one army. Someone's going to get attack her at some point, and... I guess it's less likely people will declare war on her. I have this thing I should give out to someone for sure. Uh, no. I just... Uh, there's no reason to do that. I just want, to, I just want you to die, alright? Oh my god, there's a maybe on Sima Wei. Oh my god, I can make him a vassal right now. And then annex him. I don't care if I become fucking... Minus 30 respect or whatever. Holy shit, that is... What about you? How close is that to being... If I just... Oh... <laughs> Okay, I can't do Sima Ai. Oh, no, that's not... Wow, that is apparently... What? How is... The... Wait, I'm so confused. Why would Sima Wei not think it's an unreasonable offer? Oh my god, I think i got to jump on this while I have the chance, right? I don't necessarily have to annex him right away, but making him my vassal immediately? Fuck yeah. I'm all, I'm all about that, boy. <sighs> yeah, so yeah, while we're not annexing him, it doesn't matter... I don't have to, yeah, okay. I'll definitely annex him in the future, though. The moment I, I need his help or something, oh, there's still, still Sima Ying as well, of course. Who becomes a free, no, no, wait, is he a vassal of Sima Wei? He is, isn't he? I oh, know, Sima Ai, okay, never mind. So yeah, Sima Wei, vassalize him. We can annex him at any point, that's one prince taken out immediately. Sima Liang is about to be dead. Uh, Sima Yu is our next target, I think. Um, so he shouldn't be too much of a problem either. Sima Ai and Sima Ying will be the last one. Sima Ai will be difficult to kill his faction off, but... You want to be my vassal? Oh, I can't, actually. While well, you're in this... Oh, right. <laughs> I definitely am going to vassalize you right now. Um, I'm not going to take... I'm not going to let this opportunity slide. I wonder if that's supposed to be a... If that's like... No, it's not breaking any treaties, of course not. No, I'm not, I'm not declaring war on him or whatever. Okay, I've got some items that I don't think I'll ever be using myself. I got some items to give out as well, by the way. Let's have a look at that. 
Uh, this one, that one as well, I think. How much it is worth to you? 4.3, the usual, okay. Fair enough. I have a food deal with you right now, do I not? Yeah, so I can't actually get, I can't give you food. I certainly hope I can get here without actually having to do anything too ludicrous. I can give him a couple of these ones, the war blades. Yeah, those are worth a lot. And I guess this is not that insane, so let's pop that in there as well. Okay, that's the best number I can get unless giving unless I give him one more war blade. That brings him out to 14.4. I don't want to give her give him that because that's exactly against what I want to do right now. So I'd have to give you probably quite a bit of money. Okay, a free grand or so per turn. It's a lot of money, but uh, what is that going to do for me? Zero point three and down this downgrade that a little bit. Ugh. All right. So that would be the deal right now, or I drop the food by quite a bit more and I give him a Warblade. I seem to be getting Warblades left and right, so I'm not really using them. Over. Oh, you know what? No, hold on. I can do something a little bit better. Hold on. Let's give out some items, first of all. Armies. Uh, because you... No, not you. Is it you? All these items look fucking insane. Yeah, you're losing that ranged block chance item. Right, I'm, I'm taking that away from you. Here you go. Sorry, but that's a much better item to trade. I'm also going to just give away some items here, so... Um, you. Here you go. Take this. I, I gotta equip some stuff, you know, in the meantime. Um, anything that needs to get equipped. He's gonna get equipped right now. I don't think there's much else you know is a rope. Yeah, so anyone who wants a rope, here you go. I'll take this rope. I'm definitely not giving that one away. Um, you are yellow, yeah. I've got expertise and resolve available, but I think everyone's got that already, as far as I'm aware. Yeah, looks like it. Okay. Um, you already have that, and then there's no, yeah, you're the only current sentinel I'm using. All right, okay, so that that's, takes care of all of the stuff that I was gonna trade away. I can I can definitely give him free grant. I'm gonna get a whole bunch of money from his income anyway, so we're having him be my vassal. Okay, so I will give you one of these, that one. Good offer that I'd say. Wouldn't you say so too? Uh, the axe, or what else was I giving him? This one probably. Uh, that one actually. I'm less likely to use that since I have more rangers outfits, which have the same purpose. Alright, that brings me to 9.7. I'll give you all my current money. Oh, sorry. That one. And I will pay you three grand or something per turn. Less than that. Yeah, that item saving me a lot of money. Something like that? No, that's probably not close. Nope. An extra hundred. There you go. And then he's my vassal. And I can, at any point, whenever I want, I can fucking vassalize this dude. He's gonna lose all of his vassals, I guess. Wait, does he have any vassals? He doesn't have any vassals. I thought he had vassals. No, he just has allies, of course. So he's gonna lose all of his allies, I suppose, but... Because I'm in a different alliance, he's gonna join my alliance, I imagine. He's strength rank 2. How the fuck's he joining me? How is, why would he become my vassal? I don't understand. But, here we go. Don't declare your independence, please. My income... Oh god, here we go. Uh, choose Zhong is actively waging war against our vassal Sima Wei. Okay, we got the same thing again. Better fucking... Wait, hold on. But he was in an alliance with them. So all his allies just declared war on him? What? Oh shit. No, I don't want immediate peace of the Jin Empire. No! No! <laughs> Damn it! Oh my god. Okay, so I just lost all my wars, I think. Still war of this person. And I've still got the alliance war. Oh, the alliance war against the Jin Empire remains. Never mind. We're good. Okay, my income doesn't appear to have changed at all because I'm gave, giving him two and a half grand. I guess I'm getting back two and a half grand. That's good. So he left the coalition. Oh my 
God. This is a weird fucking turn. I don't know what the hell is going on right now, but I'm loving it. Okay, you still haven't moved. I'm, I'm aware of this. Right, I still was debating attacking that fucking lumber yard over there. <laughs> I don't know. How does it take me so long to decide? Okay, that, that's a way too... Yeah, I'm not going to do that one right now. Let us... Uh, are we mustering at all? No, we're not. Let's go over here and muster. We're, um... Camp. Okay. Right, so we have a vassal in Sima Way now. So just out of curiosity, we can now... Wait, also we got trade available. That's Sima Way though, I don't want that. We can now just annex him, right? He doesn't like it, but I mean, how is that relevant? It's not a choice, is it? It, um, it makes me super unrespected, I believe. I don't want to do this right now. I don't want to accidentally make this happen immediately. I'm pretty sure it gives me a warning. Yeah, we got minus 34. Um, also puts heavy burden on your administration, so you will not be able to repeat it for a while. That's fair enough. Okay, yeah, so I'm going to lose. I'm going to become treacherous for fucking ages, but I think that's probably worth it. I'm not going to do it right now. But that is kind of nice to know that I can do that at any point. Why are you still there? Why aren't you like part of... Yeah, you're my vessel. Sima Yan as well. Gotta catch all the Simas. Okay, cool. Why? Right, what else we got? You can become a vassal now to this these random people here. Yeah, sure. Let me just do that real quick. Well, aggression pact. Okay, so... I think if I peace out of her, I actually do complete that mission. Because I'm still at war, technically. But it's with two alliance wars. I'm not, I don't think they count, but I'm not sure about that. I would, I would, I don't see why they wouldn't. But anyway, can I see these characters now? No, even though you're my vassal, I can't see shit. Yeah, he's got fucking loads of armies over here as well. Oh, this is nice to know. There's an army right there. That is very useful to know, actually. So are you no longer at war with the Jin Empire either? Then? You should be. Actually, no. I guess I can hold on. I can call you to war against the Jin Empire, but then the Jin Empire starts running around through his land, taking shit. Although you have an army there as well. The thing is, if he starts taking the Jin Empire towns, there's less for me to take, but on the other hand... <laughs> on the other hand, it means that um, there's more for me to annex, I suppose. I don't want to wait too long with annexing either, because when I do... Or, if I don't, I should say, there's the chance, of course, that he will just declare his independence at some point. I mean, he's the second strongest faction in the game. Only weaker than I am currently. And somehow he became my vassal, and I have no idea why. Um, but hey, at least he's part of our alliance again after a very long fucking time. Uh, oh God, this is just so weird. What am I supposed to do right now? How do I move from here? How do I... Continue my life from here. I'm gonna keep you in here for another turn because again, I think there's an army around here somewhere from them Like not this but something else Which could very easily fuck me right now by the way if they if they are in range of this town, which I imagine they are um, And then we're just gonna trespass for Sima Wei's territory again and attack these guys or just take Sima Wei out first And I'll take those two armies to do that one army down this route take those three towns and we're good uh, In the meantime over here we pieced out there, so you can start taking these towns around here, possibly go down that way afterwards. Yeah, I think everything is pretty much clear path-wise. I think we're going to end the turn. You took this this turn, yeah. So i got to be careful of that army. I don't know where it's going, but I have vision now, so that's nice. There's Simul Young. Okay, that's just that. Doesn't mean I didn't replenish right now. I don't know why they siege me out, but... Uh, okay, I pissed off Sima Ai again, but I want to keep this war going. Didn't actually say I was going to piss him off, but still. Okay, he's running over that way. Fair enough. Fair enough. Have it your way. Still making so much money. No, Man Hui Rui. Were you in. No, you weren't in an army. 63 years old. That sucks. Mind or might? Mind gets me closer to shit I don't want, although. Ammunition is not bad, but um, I don't care about spy stuff too much. I don't care about upkeep spy cost. I don't care. Well, network cost for enemy spies is nice. Um, 
One of your courtiers is loudly and dramatically denounced to one of his opponents as a spy. In private, they accuse that the accused admits this fact with Beck's protection. In exchange, they will give you valuable secret information. I've I've got a feeling this might get me below. Well, it probably won't get me below the requirements to get high, but I want to make sure I don't get down there. So they're executed. Fuck off. You were a spy. Even though I've hired every spy up until now, I'm very trustworthy or trusting apparently. Um. Yes, right. So let me do one thing before I end this turn. Ooh, did we take attrition? No, we didn't. We wouldn't have taken attrition immediately, but we will do soon. We're gonna replace this guy, and then I'll move on to murder the final Sima Liang army. I'm guessing maybe there wasn't another army. I could have sworn there was, but is she gonna fucking survive this? I bet you she is. Yep, she survived. Unbelievable. She killed 65 men as well. <laughs> what the fuck? I can't, we got an uncommon talent from that? Seriously? Who is this? Shi Yang Rui. Vain, deceitful. You know what kind of doesn't make sense about this, by the way? I just realized. That uh, you can... Basically what these things are, right? Um, Those enemies that aren't slain in battle are captured. Our success lies partly in the actions of one captain who was seen to defeat a great many enemies. A great example of the ideals that sh everyone should strive for. So, you know, that's all, fi all fine and dandy. However, um, when you're... When these Like, you can recruit female generals, but these units are all men. Every single one of them is men. And there's no female captains or anything. It's all men. So there's no way that a female could actually be, you know, joining the faction that way, or becoming in a higher rank. She survived again, but of course she is dead. She's fucking dead. Killed 12 men. That should be the Sima Liang faction gone. Unless it isn't. There isn't an army. I knew it. I had a feeling... Okay, I was actually going to end the episode, but now I'm forced to do more shit because of this. Actually, no, I can attack right here, and that's fine. Uh, yeah. I will fight that one manually. Wait, do you... An explosive shot? Yeah, does every army have two trebuchets now, by the way? Because at some point... Yeah, there you go. That one doesn't yet. Wait, what is this army? Is this, yeah, this is the one all the way up here. Okay, this is our shittiest army. By far, and there's a, a army there that is probably not that bad. Um, look at all these fucking horse cam. We got heavy mounted archers. Yeah. What am I comparing them to right now? To crossbows, okay. Um, I'll get another trebuchet, and then I'm going to besiege this town here. I'll fight that one manually. It's a uh, lumberyard, so hopefully they'll sally out, but yeah, they probably will do. It's not going to be the, the best battle, these ones. The lumberyards are sometimes a bit annoying. This map's a bit annoying, but it's okay. Next time, though, until then, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. This has been a very eventful episode. Quite happy with how things are going right now. Uh, and until next time, have a good day and goodbye.